Americans spent more than 11 billion on teeth whitening in 2015, including more than 1.4 billion on at-home whitening products. When it comes to whitening your teeth, you have plenty of options. However, most whitening products use chemicals to bleach your teeth, which many people are concerned about, and rightly so. If you want white your teeth, but don't want to use chemicals, I have compiled a list of six options that are both natural and safe. Also, stick around until the end, because I'll share with you some other teeth whitening methods that haven't been scientifically proven and that you shouldn't be using. To begin, what causes yellow teeth? Your teeth becomes dull and lose their bright white sparkle due to a variety of factors. Certain foods can stain the enamel, the outermost layer of your teeth. Plaque buildup on your teeth can also cause them to appear yellow. This type of discoloration is usually treatable with regular cleaning and whitening solutions. However, teeth can appear yellow because the hard enamel has eroded, exposing the dentine beneath. Dentine is a yellow bony tissue that exists beneath the enamel. Let's get started with our six steps to naturally whiten your teeth. Number one is oil pulling. Oil pulling is a traditional Indian folk remedy used to improve oral hygiene and rid the body of toxins. Swishing around oil in your mouth removes bacteria, which can turn into plaque and cause your teeth to appear yellow. For oil pulling, Indians traditionally use sunflower or sesame seed oil, but any oil will do. Coconut oil is a popular choice because it tastes as good and has numerous health benefits. Coconut oil is also high in lauric acid, which is known for its anti-inflammatory and antibacterial properties. A few studies have found that oil pulling on a daily basis reduces bacteria in the mouth as well as plaque and gingivitis. Put one tablespoon of coconut oil in your mouth and push and pull the oil through your teeth to oil pull. At room temperature, coconut oil is solid, so you may need to wait a few seconds for it to melt. Continue with the oil pulling for another 15 to 20 minutes. If you spit the coconut oil into a toilet, it may solidify and cause a clog in your drain pipes. Coconut oil pulling, unlike many other tooth whitening methods, does not expose your teeth to acid or other ingredients that may erode the enamel. This means it's safe to do on a daily basis. Number two, brushing with baking soda. Baking soda has natural whitening properties, which is why it is commonly used in commercial toothpaste. It's a mild abrasive that can aid in the removal of surface stains on the teeth. Furthermore, baking soda creates an alkaline environment in your mouth which inhibits the growth of bacteria. This is not a quick fix for teeth whitening, but you should notice a difference in the appearance of your teeth over time. Although the science has yet to prove that brushing your teeth with plain baking soda will whiten them, several studies have shown that toothpaste containing baking soda has a significant whitening effect. According to one study, toothpaste containing baking soda was significantly more effective than standard toothpaste without baking soda at removing yellow stains from the teeth. The stronger the effect, the higher the concentration of baking soda. Furthermore, a meta-analysis of five studies discovered that baking soda toothpaste removed plaque from the teeth more effectively than non-baking soda toothpaste. To use this remedy, make a paste of one teaspoon baking soda with two teaspoons water and brush your teeth with it. This can be done a few times per week. Three, use hydrogen peroxide. Hydrogen peroxide is a naturally occurring bleaching agent that kills bacteria in the mouth. Because of its ability to kill bacteria, hydrogen peroxide has been used to disinfect wounds for years. Many commercial whitening products contain hydrogen peroxide, but in much higher concentrations than you will use. Fortunately, no studies have been conducted to investigate the effects of rinsing or brushing with hydrogen peroxide alone. However, several studies have been conducted to examine commercial toothpaste containing peroxide. According to one study, using toothpaste containing baking soda and 1% hydrogen peroxide resulted in significantly whiter teeth. However, there are some concerns about hydrogen peroxide safety. While highly diluted concentrations appear to be safe, high concentrations or excessive use can cause gum irritation and tooth sensitivity. There is also concern that high doses may cause cancer though this is yet to be proven. One application for hydrogen peroxide is a mouthwash before brushing your teeth. To avoid side effects, make sure you're using 1.5% or 
or 3% solution. 3% solution of hydrogen peroxide is the most commonly found concentration at the pharmacy. By combining equal parts peroxide and water, you can easily dilute this concentration to 1.5%. Another way to use hydrogen peroxide is to make toothpaste by combining it with baking soda. Brush your teeth gently with a mixture of 2 teaspoons hydrogen peroxide and 1 teaspoon baking soda. Use this homemade paste only a few times per week to avoid eroding your tooth enamel. Number 4. Eat fruits and vegetables. A diet rich in fruits and vegetables may be beneficial to both the body and the teeth. While not a replacement for brushing, crunchy raw fruits and vegetables can help rub plaque away as you chew. Strawberries and pineapples have both been claimed to help whiten your teeth. Teeth whitening with a strawberry and baking soda mixture is a natural remedy popularized by celebrities. Proponents of this method claim that malic and strawberries will remove discoloration from your teeth while baking soda will buff away stains. While strawberries may help exfoliate and whiten your teeth, they are unlikely to penetrate the stains on your teeth. If you decide to try this method, only use it a few times per week. To use this remedy, mash a fresh strawberry, mix it with baking soda and brush it on your teeth. people believe that pineapple can whiten your teeth. A study discovered that toothpaste containing bromelain, an enzyme found in pineapples, was significantly more effective than standard toothpaste at removing tooth stains. There is, however, no evidence that eating pineapples have the same effect. Number 5. Prevent food stains from occurring in the first place. While your teeth are naturally yellow as you age, there are some things you can do to help prevent stains. Limit the consumptions of staining foods and beverages. Coffee, red wine, soda and dark berries are notorious for causing tooth discoloration. Drink beverages that are known to stain your teeth through a straw if possible to avoid direct contact with your teeth. Furthermore, brush your teeth approximately 30 minutes after consuming one of these foods or beverages to minimize their effects on the color of your teeth. Both smoking and chewing tobacco can cause tooth discoloration. Reduce your sugar intake. Reduce your sugar intake if you want whiter teeth. If you eat something sugary, brush your teeth right away. Make sure you get plenty of calcium in your diet. Some tooth discoloration is caused by enamel eroding and exposing the yellow dentine underneath. As a result, anything you do to strengthen your teeth's enamel will keep your teeth pearly white. Calcium-rich foods like milk, cheese, and broccoli may help protect your teeth's enamel from erosion. Number six, don't undervalue the importance of brushing and flossing. While some tooth discoloration occurs naturally with age, it is primarily caused by plaque buildup. Brushing and flossing on a regular basis can help your teeth stay white by reducing bacteria in your mouth and preventing plaque buildup. Toothpaste gently removes stains from your teeth while flossing removes bacteria that causes plaque. Dental cleanings on a regular basis can also help your teeth stay clean and white. Now for the bonus that you've stuck around for, other methods that have yet to be proven. There are a few other natural teeth whitening methods, but no scientific evidence exists to support their safety or effectiveness. Among the proven methods are charcoal activated, Brushing your teeth with powdered charcoal is said to remove toxin from your mouth and remove stains from your teeth. Clay made from kaolin. Brushing with clay, according to proponents, helps remove stains from your teeth. It is claimed that rubbing orange, lemon or banana peels on your teeth will whiten them. Vinegar made from apple cider. On the contrary, it erodes the tooth enamel and contributes to tooth decay. Although proponents of these methods claim they significantly whiten teeth, no studies have been conducted to evaluate their efficiency. This also implies that they have not been thoroughly tested for potential side effects when used on teeth. There you have it. I hope you liked this video. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe.